Hey, what's going on guys? It's Gold Gas here with another episode of how to put a boiler into service mode. Hey guys, Gold Gas here. This episode's about putting the main multi-point FF into service mode and adjusting the burner pressures. If you enjoy, please drop a like. And if you want to see more service bits and gas works, be sure to subscribe and check out my channel. Make sure you make a note of the temperature settings or take a photo I find is easiest or any programs that you've changed or hot water temperature uh, so you can set it back at the end when you finish the service or whatever job you're doing. This will avoid the customer calling you up saying uh, something like the hot water is too hot or too cold. Just uh, stops any aggro. You need the appliance off on the selector switch. While that's off, hold down the burner lit button. And whilst holding that button down, turn the selector switch to on. And you're looking out for a green flashing light on that burner light or indicator. Once that light's flashing, turn the temperature dial fully clockwise. And then run the hot tap. This should give you your high or maximum output and your burner pressure. I'll do a screenshot of the burner pressures here. Then you can turn the selector switch down to minimum and then take your burner pressure reading again with the hot tap running. To adjust the minimum, you want to use a non-magnetic a Phillips screwdriver or flathead, anything that goes in that crosshead bit on the gas valve. So pull the control panel off um, while the burner is running and you can turn that crosshead part in the middle of the gas valve until you hit that adjustment spot you need. For the maximum, it's that nut on the outside of that screw on the middle of the gas valve and you want to get some small adjustables or little spanner and then you can turn that to adjust that setting as well. Turn the selector dial to off the zero, turn the tap off and that's it you've completed the burner adjustments if needed. Turn the selector switch back on that green light shouldn't be flashing on the burner indicator. That about does it for this episode if you've enjoyed don't forget to drop a like and if there's anything you want to see, like how to service a boiler or a question about a particular boiler, even one that I haven't shown yet, leave a comment below and I should get back to you. Cheers folks, stay safe.